All right, everybody. So today we are going to start working on a shed to put out in the paddocks with the goats. Um, we're going to build it on some skids with a little little place for them to get in at night and kind of stay warm and whatnot. And uh, it'll be a place where we can catch the rainwater. We're going to put a barrel on the front, and we can we'll be able to catch the rainwater and have water in there for them all the time, as opposed to having to water them every day or sometimes two times a day. Um, it's this this will probably be part one of two or three. We're not gonna be able to do it all in one video. We're just gonna break it down over a couple of videos. And maybe whenever it's done we will do a time lapse kind of the of the whole build all together from start to finish. But uh we're just gonna put these videos out a couple of two or three in a little series just to kind of give y'all a breakdown as to what we're doing. And uh, let's get into it. Now, I don't know if a lot of y'all can see this or not, but we are reusing some wood that was on a shed that we tore down. So we're gonna have to beat all the nails and crap out of it to uh, reuse it. Say that I'm making it, just get the saw out and cut the ends off. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna get the saw out. Actually, I'll put it in that chop though. Okay, so what we got going on is we have two 4x4 posts like this, this one, and this one. So on the front, we cut these at a 45 degree angle. We're going to put an uh, eye bolt in the side, and we'll be able to hook a rope or a chain or something too, and drag it with, uh, with a ranger or, or just with manpower. It's not going to be super heavy. But uh, what we're gonna do is, these boards are eight feet long. So what we're gonna do is, it's gonna end up being five foot wide from side to side. And from the back to the front will be six foot. And we'll leave the, the two foot on the front. What we're gonna do is we're gonna build a, uh, it's just gonna be like a little deck. And it's gonna have the water catchment drum and then a uh, feed bucket on the side that way we can kind of have it all enclosed in one area when we move the goats the feed the water everything goes along with them so we're going to cut the boards that go in between here and get them screwed together
up going five foot wide and it's six foot long to this last two by four over here. And then we'll frame up this, this last little section right down here. We'll frame up this little section and we'll, that's where we'll put the, uh, the water drum and the stuff on it. But that's where we're at today. So we we'll go ahead and continue the series on here. Okay, so as you can see, as we put it up, well, let me walk out here for a little bit. Lighting's a, lighting's a little better out here. So, as you can see, as he's finishing up running them screws in the rest of that little frame, that's, uh, that's how much we got accomplished today, which is not bad. All right, so go ahead and uh, stay tuned for the rest of the series. We'll probably... Probably uh, we gotta go to town get some plywood and stuff to be able to put the bottom decking on there. But uh, go ahead and stay tuned. We'll be posting another video here. And, oh, tomorrow or the next day, whenever we decide to wrap up on this. On this day. Oh Lord, the lighting's horrible right there. So uh, yeah, go ahead and subscribe to the channel if you're new. Uh, like the videos. Leave some comments on the videos and uh, hit that little notification bell. That way you'll be notified when we upload some new videos. So, until the next one.